<laughs> Go Buster! Wow! Buster's become a rocket, and he's going to space! Five, four, three, two, one! Blast off! Look at Buster go! All right! You did it, Buster! You're in outer space! What a cool place to be! I think Buster wants to go space exploring! Look at that! It's a red planet! Let's go in for a closer look! Hey there, little space buddy! I bet that alien has never seen a bus before! Where are you off to now, Buster? Oh, a yellow planet! It's so beautiful with that huge ring around it! Look at that! Buster's gonna go for a drive around the ring! Let's see how fast you can go! Whoa! That was fun! What's Buster seen now? It's a purple planet! Isn't it huge? Whoa! Round and round the planets Buster goes! Round the purple planet, the yellow planet, and the red planet! But wait! Oh no! A blue planet! Buster's going too fast! I think he's going to hit it! Oh, thank goodness! It was only a dream! You're okay, Buster. Look, Scout is using her telescope to look at the night sky. Take a look, Buster. There's the purple planet, the yellow planet, and the red planet. Hello, little space buddy. Ash is coming round to play at Buster's house. They're really excited to play some board games. Today's game is Snakes and Ladders. How exciting. And Ash gets to go first. Five and two, that's seven. So Ash moves his counter seven spaces. Now it's Buster's turn. Eight, along the counter goes. Now it's Ash's turn again. Oh wow, he's rolled very well. He's going up a ladder. Now Buster, five. Oh dear, down the snake he goes. Buster's not doing well. Oops, he knocked over his counter. What's that? Here comes Grandpa with lots of other toys to play with, but he's dropped them all. Ash is helping to pick them all up. But no one is watching Buster. Oh no, he moved his counter up. But that's cheating. Oh no, he's moved it to the finish line like he's won the game. Now Ash is back. Looks like the game is over. Buster won. Ash doesn't understand how that happened, but he's happy for his friend. Ah. That's odd. Buster should feel happy he won, but he doesn't feel right. Not right at all. Buster cheated. He didn't win fair and square, so it feels all wrong. But Grandpa knows it's not all about winning. It's playing the game that's the fun part. And now it's Ash's turn. Ash rolls. Whoa, he almost went down the snake. Buster goes down another snake and there, Ash won fair and square. But Buster is happy for his friend. They had so much fun playing together. It's a brand new day and it's time for Buster to head off to school. There's Diggly, they can go to school together. They're going to race to school. Whoosh, I wonder who will be fastest. Whoa, there's a little duckling in the road. He should be more careful. There's a mommy duck. She's trying to cross the road with her ducklings. But look out, here comes Terry. Here comes the teacher too. Oh no. Phew. Thanks to Diggly and Buster, the duck family can cross the road safely. Aw, they're going to swim in that pond. Uh-oh, that duckling is walking back to the road. 
<laughs> Good job, Buster. Now the ducks are going back over the road. Buster and Diggly are helping them cross safely. <laughs> Mommy Duck is crossing too. Well done everyone for helping! <laughs> but Terry and the teacher want to get moving or they'll be late. Wait a minute. I think Buster has an idea. Hmm. What are they doing with those paints? White lines? And some signs? It's a duck crossing! Now the duck family can cross the road safely whenever they like! There's the teacher again. He's telling them to hurry up. The kids had better get to school or they'll be late. Nice work, everyone! <laughs> There, Buster. Oh wow, look at that! You're in the Wild West! <laughs> and check out your cowboy hat! That must be the sheriff with his shiny gold star. Oh look! A lasso! Great work, Buster! Now you're a proper cowboy! There's Terry! Tip your hat, cowboy, and say hello! I don't think Terry looks too impressed. Wait! <gasps> It's Bandit Bus! And what's that on his back? A sack? I think he's robbed the sweet shop! What a villain he is! You must stop him, Buster! <laughs> Quick, Buster! He's getting away! Chase after him! <gasps> Wake up, Sheriff! There's a robber on the loose! They're speeding alongside the train tracks! Faster, Buster! You can't let Bandit escape! Wow! Bandit jumped in front of Suki the train! Wait for the train to pass and... Where did he go? Oh no, he's going the other way! That was sneaky! After him, Buster! Bandit is trying to lose Buster in the cactus field! Careful, Buster! Those are really spiky! You've almost caught him! Look out! Are you okay, Buster? Oh no! The cactus has punctured your tire! Oh no, you'll never catch him with a flat tire. Wait, huh? of course! The lasso! Rope him up, Buster. One, two, three, go! Great, you did it! You caught Bandit. And here's Sheriff Otis. I'm sure he's really grateful. There, Bandit is in the jailhouse where he belongs. Oh wow, Sheriff Buster. What an exciting dream that was! Happy trails, Buster! Buster is heading off to school! Wait a second, Buster! Don't forget, it's school photo day today! So you need an extra polish! Bye, Mommy Bus! Look! Terry Tractor is here to take the school photos! Bandit and Ash are up first! Smile! Buster's turn next! And he wants to get an action shot! Whoops! Buster slipped! Watch out, Scout! Oh no, what's wrong? The teacher is handing Buster a mirror! <gasps> Buster has knocked out his wobbly front tooth! Oh no! And now Buster is too embarrassed to have his photo taken. It's okay, Buster. You can have it taken another day. Buster is feeling really sad about missing out on the photos. But Mommy Bus is here to pick him up. And she's taking him to the dentist to get his tooth looked at. Hooray! Oh. Buster is a little bit nervous. Don't worry, Buster. Amber the ambulance is here to take a look at that tooth for you. It's time to sit in the special dentist chair. Wow, that looks like so much fun! And now it's time to check that tooth. 
Don't worry, Buster. There's nothing to be scared of. First, Amber is looking at the tooth with a little mirror. Open wide, Buster. Say, ah. And what's that? Amber's going to play Buster a video. It's another bus, just like Buster. <laughs> and his tooth has fallen out. But don't worry, another one will grow in its place. He might be missing a tooth for now, but soon he'll have a brand new one. So there's nothing to be embarrassed about. <laughs> Buster now feels much better. Thanks, Amber. <laughs> And now he's going back to school to get his photo taken. <laughs> Gather in, Buster. Yes. Say cheese. <laughs> hey there, Buster. <laughs> What's that poster there? <laughs> hmm, a fire truck? Sure looks exciting, doesn't it? Look, it's Ashley the fire truck. <laughs> I think Buster wants to join the fire brigade. Uh. <laughs> Go on, Buster. Time to get ready for your first day on the job. Just a few little changes and... <laughs> wow! Look at that. Buster really is a fire truck. He's got a ladder, a siren, and a water hose. Uh-oh, the fire alarm. There's a fire somewhere. Ashley has to go and take care of it. You stay here, Buster. Hey, it's Tony the truck. Watch out for that puddle. Oh, no! That falling box started a fire at the fire station. What are we going to do? Quick, Buster the fire truck, put that fire out. Uh-oh, the fire has spread to the roof. Keep blasting water, Buster. Hooray, Robin is here to help. And Ashley's back too. <gasps> you can do it if you work together. Two fire trucks are better than one. Phew, the fire is out at last. Nice work, Buster and Ashley. <laughs> Look, it's that poster again. Now it's Buster on the poster. Whoa, you really are a hero, Buster. I wonder what Buster and Digger are doing. <laughs> wow, who painted that? Looks like you guys want some ice cream. <gasps> Digger, <laughs> that is one big ice cream cone. Oh look, here comes Iggy, the ice cream truck. Buster and Digger want Iggy to help make them the giant ice cream. Now let's see. Oh, cherries. Mmm, that's a delicious flavor. Let's pick that. Wow, look at all that ice cream. Right, next we need a blue ice cream. Blueberries? Perfect! <laughs> that is looking so good, Buster! Okay, yellow next. Bananas, good choice! <laughs> you want more? Okay, this has to be the last flavor, otherwise it will be too big. Apple it is. This is going to be one tasty ice cream. <laughs> one last effort, Iggy. That ice cream looks quite wobbly. Steady as you go, Digger. Robin has come to get Scout so that she can find out what Buster and Digger have made for her birthday. You better follow Robin, Scout. Happy birthday, Scout! That is the biggest ice cream I have ever seen! Oh no, Digger! 
Watch out, Scout! That was close. <laughs> Blow the candle out, Scout. Now you can all tuck into the ice cream. <laughs> yum, yum. <laughs> and Robin. Buster looks like he's enjoying that bubble gum a lot. What's that? A message in a bottle. I wonder what it is. Whoa! It's a treasure map. X marks the spot. Buster and Robin are going to find the buried treasure. Now which way should they go? There's the jetty. And look! There's the desert island. They found it. Uh-oh. The water is full of sharks. They'll need to find a safe way across. <laughs> Look, it's Katrina, the steamboat. She's stuck on the beach. She could use a push back into the water. That's it, Buster. Well done. Great. Katrina is back on the water. But oh dear, there's a hole. Katrina could sink if someone doesn't fix it. I think Buster has a plan. I wonder what he's doing with the bubble gum. Oh! He's using the bubble gum to block up the hole. Very clever, Buster. The sharks won't catch them now. Next stop, the desert island. Great! Buster's arrived on the island. Now he just needs to find the treasure. It's around here somewhere. There! X marks the spot! Buster's digging down. Wow! A treasure chest! Look! A coin! I wonder what Buster will use it for. Look! Diggly is working on Katrina, fixing up her leak. Oh! Buster is using the coin to pay Diggly. He's helping Katrina get fixed to say thank you to his new friend. What a fun adventure! Buster is at Daddy's house today. Oh look! It's Daddy Bus! Tomorrow, Buster is going back to school. It's going to be great! But first, they need to get ready. Daddy Bus has a checklist of everything Buster needs before he goes back to school tomorrow. <laughs> he needs his rucksack, a lunchbox, his school book, a pencil case, and a ruler. Hmm. Rucksack, check. Lunchbox, check. Everything else, check. And last but not least, the shark tooth from his holiday for show and tell. Wow! Buster needs to get a good night's sleep before school tomorrow. Good night, Buster. There goes the alarm. It must be time to get up. Oh no! Buster has gone back to sleep! Oh dear. And now he's going to be late for school! Quick! They've got to get everything ready! What does Buster need? Rucksack? Check. Lunchbox? Check. Pencil case and school book, check. But what is he missing? The ruler. Aha, there it is. It's time to head off for school. Wait a second, Buster forgot his shark tooth. Quick Buster, quick. Shark tooth? Check. They're going to have to race to get there on time. Go, Buster! Looks like the teacher is getting worried. All his friends are already at school and he's going to be late. Oh no! Hmm? 
Phew! He did it! Just in time! What a crazy morning! Buster the bus and Scout the car are playing soccer. Buster shoots. Goal! Well done, Buster! Great work! Whoa! It's a soccer bus! He plays for the big bus soccer team. He wants Buster to come try out for the team. But oh no, Buster is too shy. Scout encourages him, and Buster says okay. He'll come to the big game tomorrow. Scout is very proud of her friend, but Buster is still nervous. That night, Buster is sleeping peacefully in his garage. Buster dreams he's playing on the big bus soccer team. The game starts, but oh dear, the buses play rough. Now it's Buster's turn in goal. He tries to save it, but oh dear, the soccer buses don't look very impressed. Poor Buster, he's tried so hard. Phew, it was just a bad dream. But now Buster's even more nervous about trying out for the team. Scout does her best to encourage him. Buster can do it. She believes in him. Now it's time for the big game. Robin blows his whistle and the game begins. Oh no, the red bus has been injured. They can't play anymore. Buster will have to step in. Go on, Buster, you can do it. Buster kicks the ball and the game goes on. Buster is going in goal now. The blue bus takes a shot and... Buster saved it! Well done, Buster! You did so well! Hooray! That was so much fun! Buster is so excited to go play with his best friend, Scout. What'll they play today? Ooh! Grandpa has a remote-controlled car! Buster is going to control it first. Vroom, vroom! Look at it go! Now Scout wants to go. But Buster wants to keep driving. Uh-oh, Scout doesn't think that's fair. She wants a turn. Oh dear! Now they're fighting over the remote! They both want to control the toy car! Oh no! The car crashed and broke! Now nobody can play with it! Buster and Scout are upset with each other! They're not playing anymore! It's so sad when friends argue. But wait, I think Grandpa has an idea. He's giving the remote to Scout and the toy car to Buster. They'll need to work together to fix it. <laughs> Aw, oh, now they've made up. Oh. Friends always <laughs> forgive each other. <laughs> there! Now they can both control the car. <laughs> the round and hear the fairy tale of Buster the Wizard. There's Buster the bus. Looks like he's driving through the enchanted forest. But wait, what's this by the road? I think it's a spell book. Wow, Buster can use that to do magic. Look! It's Scout, Terry, and Jesse in the town square. I think Buster's going to try casting some spells. Let's see now. Whoa, a wizard's hat. Buster really is doing magic. I wonder what spell Buster can use to help Terry. Abracadabra. Wow, Buster made the plants grow. Nice work, wizard Buster. 
<laughs> what other spells are in the spell book? The B spell? <laughs> oh, look! Buster turned Scout into a bee! She's having so much fun flying around! I think Jessie wants to fly too! What spells are there for that? Bubbles? Cool! Jessie's floating around in her own bubble! Nice work, Wizard Buster! Oh, look, he's very sleepy! Time for a nap, Buster! Uh-oh! I think something's gone wrong! The magic is out of control! Quick, Buster! You've got to put everything back to normal! Hurry, Buster! Phew! All the spells are cancelled! But I don't think Buster's friends are very happy with him. Buster's putting the spell book back where he found it. And that's the end of the fairy tale of Buster the Wizard. It's a sunny day at Buster's house. And Buster and Grandpa are having a great time playing together. Mommy Bus is off to work. Will Buster and Grandpa be able to make dinner together? Whoa! Some real cooking! Buster is very excited. Let's cook! Grandpa sets up the stove. Hmm, but what comes next? Buster has an idea. It's chocolate sauce! Hmm, Grandpa doesn't think that's quite right for dinner. Let's take a look at the recipe. They've gathered all the ingredients together. Buster starts by adding some flour to the bowl. Whoa, easy there, Buster! Oops! The flour has gone everywhere! Now Grandpa and Buster are covered in flour! Buster is adding the finishing touches to the mixture. Careful the mixture doesn't go everywhere! Great job, Buster! Oops! Grandpa's tomato sauce has splattered all over the floor! And what's going on at the stove? The pot is bubbling over! Oh, look! It steamed up his glasses, and now he can't see where he's going! Watch out, Grandpa! Oh, dear! This isn't going very well! Grandpa and Buster are clearing up the mess. But Mommy Bus is coming home from work. Uh-oh! They still haven't made dinner! What are they going to do? Grandpa gets some fish fingers out of the freezer. Aha! This gives Buster an idea! Time for chocolate sauce! Mommy Bus is wondering what Buster and Grandpa have made for dinner, just as they're finishing up. I wonder what they've cooked. It's fish fingers and green beans. And chocolate sauce. Are you sure about this, Buster? He gives it a try. Hmm, delicious! Mommy also gives it a try. And it's surprisingly tasty. Well done, Buster! Look, it's Buster the Bus. But now he's a fish in the big blue sea. And look, there's a tiny baby shark. That crab is snapping his claws just like the baby shark's jaws. Buster wants to play with them. And look there, that must be the mommy shark. She's dancing with the crab. She looks like she's having so much fun. What fun! Look, it's Sham the shark. He must be the daddy! Now Sham is dancing excitedly with the crab. Buster is happy to see his old friend. Who's this? Glasses? Wrinkles? This must be Grandma Shark. <laughs> She's having a great time dancing with the crab too. <laughs> Look at her go! And this happy shark with a mustache? That must be Grandpa Shark. <laughs> He's having such a good time! Now Buster has met the whole shark family. Now Sham and Buster are playing together in the ocean. They're swimming through the coral and then up towards the surface. Aw, oh, but the poor little crab can't keep up. Look at Buster and Sham jump gracefully out of the water. But the little crab is having a tough time. Up Buster jumps. Whoa! Watch out, little crab! Aw, Buster wants to play together. 
Now all three of them can swim together. Oh dear, Buster looks all worn out. Sham and the crab are saying goodbye. They've had such a nice day. Oh, it was all a dream. Or was it? There's the little crab again. <laughs>